Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to a short video here on Forgotten Weapons. I'm Ian McCollum, and really this is a video I'd like to put out to my fellow content creators on YouTube in the firearms space. Obviously there's been a lot of publicity recently about some of YouTube's most recent completely ridiculous rules interpretations, and this is not a new thing. Uh, let me actually immediately backtrack to those of you who aren't YouTube content creators. YouTube is doing, has been doing this stuff to us for years now. Their rules are irrational, the rules are clearly written by people who don't understand anything about firearms, and they write rules that just literally make no sense. Uh, and then those rules, when videos are struck, or demonetized, or appealed, those rules are interpreted by other people who have even less understanding, and certainly less interest in the subject. So things have been capricious and subjective for years, and this most recent thing about suppressors and magazines is only the most recent, uh, the most recent flare-up of this complete nonsense. So I know a lot of people are looking for alternative backup platforms. I highly support this. Like if you haven't been yet, I think you're behind the curve. You absolutely should have your content posted other places than just YouTube, because I don't know when it'll happen. I don't know if it will be six months from now or ten years from now, but YouTube is going to make our lives on YouTube completely impossible. However, they remain obviously the biggest, the only real single choice in a platform. The whole audience is here on YouTube, but we need to have backups, we need to have alternatives. Now I know a lot of people are going to Rumble, I'm not convinced that Rumble's a great plan. Go for it, try it out, see if it works for you. The one that has worked by far the best for me is Utreon. And I know I've talked about this before, but this might be a really good time to get the attention of some other content creators out there who are suddenly looking uh, much more interested now in finding a good backup. The things that make Utreon great are it is a small, hungry company. They're developing, they're growing, they have been around for many years now, slowly developing their platform. Are there things that need to be improved on it still? Yeah, absolutely. But they are not one of these flash in the pan, uh, hey, we're now the new YouTube alternative site that we've seen pop up in past occurrences of this sort of YouTube behavior. Those sites show up, do something, I don't know what, and then they boof, disappear out into the ether again. Utreon is a site that is set up with a long-term plan, uh, they're dedicated to, to making it work. They're not specifically trying to replace YouTube. What they're offering is sort of an amalgamation between YouTube and Patreon. It is a, it, it's video that's free to watch if you're not a subscriber, but it also has integrated channel subscriptions, very much like Patreon, with perks, different uh, pledge levels, different perks available. Um, it is a place where you can grow a subscriber audience, a dedicated one. Uh, the people who are on Utreon are kind of the, the head of the pack, the, the people who recognize what's eventually going to happen with YouTube, and they're already looking for good alternative places to watch content that is getting harder and harder to create on YouTube, like our firearm stuff. Uh, so uh, think of it as sort of like Patreon without the political side and with their own native video hosting. So um, there are a number of ways that you can use Utreon as a backup if you have a YouTube channel. Uh, the very simplest way is simply to duplicate your YouTube channel. Utreon can scrape your new content as it appears, and rehost it on their own servers and make it available to people. That's what I did at first. The better way to use Utreon is actually to upload directly to it, um, to make those videos available uh, at the same time that your regular videos come out instead of a delay from having them scraped. Personally I have a Patreon pledge level for early access to videos and I've made that available early access to my, pay to my Utreon subscribers uh, for a lower pledge level just as one way to encourage people to go over there. Uh, Utreon has live streaming. Utreon allows you to handle guns in live streams, for example. Um, Utreon is responsive when you have questions. They will talk to you immediately. They're helpful. They're really like everything that YouTube isn't when it comes to actually supporting their content creators. So it's a great way, um, you know, there's no exclusivity to it. Absolutely keep posting stuff on YouTube. That's what I'm doing, that's what everyone's doing, because the audience primarily continues to be on YouTube, but a great way to be able to give your audience the stuff that you want to make, the, the types of content, the specific video shots that you can't put on YouTube, you can put on Utreon. You can post what's available, what's possible on YouTube, say hey, 
you know, for the rest of the video, the stuff that YouTube is, is going to hammer us for posting, that's available to folks over on Utreon, whether they're paid subscribers or just free viewing uh, watchers. So um, I have no financial connection to Utreon. I don't get paid by them. My motivation in this is that they, that site has been the best, the most successful alternative backup platform for me, and I would love to see them continue to grow. And the key to continued growth there is to have the base of content creators. If we are all over on Utreon, we will build a viewing audience over on Utreon, and they'll start to recognize that, hey, this site has a lot to offer that we can't get uh, over on YouTube. There's more stuff to it, there's more details, uh, there's some other cool features, but I don't have time to get into everything. I just wanted to make this as a fairly quick little video for you guys, uh, since this subject has become very relevant uh, at this point in time. So, again, if you're on YouTube, if you make content, uh, not just firearms content, it's not a firearms specific platform. If you're watching me and you make content on some completely other subject, which is most likely also being hammered by YouTube because they just don't care about uh, independent content creators anymore, check out Utreon. I think it's a great option. Hopefully it would be a good option for you. That's all I got. Thanks for watching.